H2 is a molecule of many talents. It really is the ultimate smart guy. But just how smart is H2? Join us as we look at some of the smart roles H2 can play on this episode of H2 Minutes. Many of the therapeutic benefits of H2 come from its ability to influence cellular signaling pathways and gene expression. If you're not sure what those things are, I put a couple links in the description to explain. To put it simply, well, it really isn't simple at all. In fact, there are many things we know H2 does, but science hasn't quite figured out exactly how it does it. But this does not take away from the fact that what we know about H2 is both fascinating and exciting. But what we know is that H2 is smart. No, it doesn't have a brain or can make rational decisions, but it does play a few smart roles in the body. Let's take a look at these roles. H2 acts as security in your body. In our last two videos, we learned about oxidative stress and how H2 can act as an antioxidant to fight against it. Because this is done at the cellular level, it actually helps to protect our cells and our DNA and RNA from oxidative stress. And because H2 can activate the NRF2 pathway and upregulate our body's own antioxidant enzymes, our cells are even further protected. Not only that, but research has shown that there is still a cytoprotective effect on the body for hours or even days after H2 has left, which suggests that H2 has some ability for gene expression or cell modulation. To quote this article, one mechanism that hydrogen uses to protect against oxidative damage is by the activation of the NRF2 KEP1 system and subsequent induction of the antioxidant response element ARE pathway, which leads to the production of various cytoprotective proteins like glutathione, catalase, superoxide dismutase, glutathione peroxidase, and hemoone oxidase, etc. Thank you, H2. H2 acts as a messenger in your body. This means it can participate in the communication process. Research is demonstrating that H2 is a novel signaling molecule, meaning it can influence or alter cellular signaling pathways. So not only does H2 help our body directly, but it can also help our body indirectly. Because of its signaling molecule function, H2 can exert effects like anticellular death, anti-inflammation, anti-allergy, anti-obesity, and neuroprotection. To quote this study, we have shown that hydrogen suppresses signaling pathways in allergies and inflammation without directly scavenging reactive oxygen or nitrogen species. Signaling molecules that are modulated by hydrogen include these. Activities and expression of these molecules are modified by hydrogen. Thanks, H2. H2 acts as an analyst in your body. H2 will go into your body, assess the situation, and function depending on what's going on in there. The human body is supposed to have a normal level of measurable ROS and in inflammation. This study demonstrated that hydrogen did not produce DNA damage and inflammation when the levels were normal, but only when DNA damage and inflammation was excessive. This is a great benefit of H2 because everybody's bodies are different. Some individuals might have high levels of oxidative stress, while others might not. H2 has the potential to respond to different cellular situations and exert different therapeutic effects when needed. This makes H2 very unique as most medicines and supplements go into your body for one function only, and they will try to complete that function whether it's healthy or not to do so. To quote this article, Importantly, hydrogen only activates the NRF2 pathway when there is an assault, like a toxin or injury or etc., as opposed to constitutionally acting as a promoter, which could be harmful. Thanks a lot, H2. H2 acts as a regulator in your body. This means H2 influences the regulation of proteins, either up or down, to bring your body where it needs to be. In other words, H2 can tell the good stuff to increase at the same time, tell the bad stuff to decrease. We can use inflammation as an example. Our bodies produce pro-inflammatory cytokines that increase inflammation and anti-inflammatory cytokines that fight inflammation. Unfortunately, the levels of these cytokines can get out of balance, increasing inflammation and causing all types of pain. What H2 can do is go into your body and downregulate pro-inflammatory cytokines 
meaning it tells your body to make less of that enzyme that's been increasing all the inflammation. At the same time, H2 can upregulate your anti-inflammatory cytokines, meaning it says to make more of that enzyme to fight the inflammation which is already at work. Let's look at a quote from this article where it states, these studies all point to the notion that hydrogen modulates intracellular signal transduction systems and regulates the downstream gene expression to mitigate disease. H2, I thank you. H2 acts as a tutor to your body. Like a tutor helps a student perform better than before, H2 helps the body to perform more efficiently by motivating it to do what it already has the capability of doing. In other words, much of what H2 can do are things the body should already do naturally. Things like aging or oxidative stress or genetic mutations can create roadblocks to having optimal performance. Just as a tutor helps where needed, H2 can help to protect, boost, regulate, adjust, or express what the body already makes to function optimally. For example, here's a study regarding H2 and diabetes. In conclusion, supplementation with H2 rich water seemed to decrease serum LDLC and apple B levels improved dyslipidemia injured HDL function and reduced oxidative stress and it may have a beneficial role in prevention of potential metabolic syndrome. And if there's nothing for H2 to do, it'll just leave your body. Its feelings are not hurt if it's not needed. Would you join me in thanking H2 for all of this smart, hard work? Thank you, H2. Okay, so that was a lot of info. But I hope our examples help you understand the amazing potential of hydrogen. One more fun fact. Thus far, research has shown that over 200 biomolecules can be altered by hydrogen administration, including over a thousand gene expressions. Wow, that is a lot that can be done by a simple molecule. So how do you think you could benefit from H2? Let us know in the comments. Natural dose of H2 in two minutes times four.